Mm. It's not from NTA because they have not put it anywhere. In fact, some of the students messaged me and told, sir, suddenly the form has been changed. At least when the form for NEET 2025 has been changed, there should have been an official update by NTA. But silently they have changed certain things because of which many students might have to reapply. Else you will not be even eligible for counseling. So please listen to me very carefully. And uh, this is the same practice which they did even during the J application form. Suddenly they made certain things mandatory uh, out of the blue and uh, halfway through the application process. And suddenly many students had to face a lot of difficulties. So let's quickly get into the uh, details. Uh, please smash the like button because it is very important that you stay updated with all the latest information and also subscribe to the Vedantu Neat English channel because or else you're going to miss a lot of critical updates. Thank you. Thank you so much for uh, signing in and I hope my audible and visible. Yes, I hope I'm audible and visible to all of you. And my voice is also clear. Okay, cool. So let's see what the update is. Now, as you go into the application form, you will see that a page something like this will open up where you fill in all your details and all of that. Now, there is a particular uh, section which says social category status. Earlier, this particular social category status was optional. It was not mandatory. But now it is a compulsory, compulsory section, including the social disability uh, status. So uh, things like, you know, are you uh, an OBC, SC, ST or any other category? Do you have any disability? Are you a PWD candidate? Now, this particular section is mandatory. And let's say you are having any kind of category. You need to mention those details right now and only then only then you will be considered to be of that particular category. That is very, very important. Else, let's say you do not fill it here. Later on during counseling, you go with the certificate or maybe you uh, fill up the counseling form saying that, okay, I have this particular category. They will probably not accept it. This is the same thing which happened for J means same thing is happening for need which also means that if you have already paid, if you have already paid for the application form, you need to re-register because if you have not selected the proper category, that is, if you have selected the category, then it's fine. But if you have not selected the proper category, if you have not filled in the details, you will have to fill the form again through a different email ID, A different phone number as well. So use a different email ID, use a different phone number in case you have not registered. And that is the reason why I tell students, please don't be in a hurry to fill the form as soon as possible. Yeah, please don't fill the form as soon as possible. Take some time, take five days, take six days. Usually NTA commits these, I don't know, unnecessary blunders. And after two, three days, they come up with a new rule, they come up with a new strategy. So please make sure that you wait for a few days and then fill it off okay all right so if you can edit the option please edit it if there is an option to edit please edit it it's now compulsory to give your category be it general be it obc be it se be it st be it pwd any category you need to register you need to provide the details if you have the form right now for the category certificate you can say yes if you do not have it you can just say okay i do not have the form right now i will share it later on that option is also there so please choose it wisely so please wait for two three days and then fill it off okay don't fill it even today that's the reason why i have not yet made the video on how to fill the form let's wait maybe more changes will come all right so please wait humble request and Many students were also asking, sir, is there any test series for NEET? Yes, I have put it up in the pinned message of the live chat as well as in the comment section and soon in the description box also it will be updated. Please check that out. It is all India level 180 test series with new pattern, new timing, both online and offline mode are available. The link is there in the description box. Online, you will give it online, offline, 
papers are couriered along with the OMR sheet. New pattern, difficult pattern is also included in the test series. You can check it out. Yes, it is for 720 marks. New pattern for three hours. And I have put up the test link in the description box. All right. So do not forget to check it out. You will receive the test within one to maximum two weeks. All right, Sundar. Yeah, it's it's there at a very, very affordable price. As you can see, as you're watching this particular video, I'll just show it to you. Okay, it's there in the description box of this particular video as well. Uh, yep, you can see it's there. AITS 180 offline, AITS 180 online. You can see the AITS 180. Yes, the offline is for 1,199 rupees where the tests will be couriered to you with the OMR sheets. AITS 180 online is for 699 rupees. Okay, so both the options are available. And uh, yes, it's multiple tests, multiple patterns, difficult pattern based on the new difficulty level because this year paper is going to be obviously top notch and is in the revenge mode. Okay, yes, this is for increasing your marks because if you practice only simple tests, then you are not practicing enough. So please practice new pattern questions. Thank you so much. This was Captain Shares. Thank you for liking. Please share this video because many students or else will become ineligible. So please don't do that with your friends. Please share this video because many students might just become ineligible if they have not filled the form properly. Okay. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Take care.